there's a lot of things in life that you're going to have to do yourself. And uh, sometimes you might have lazy chickens and they don't do a good job of sitting on the eggs. And so once you have a bunch of eggs go bad, you can get frustrated with that. And you just say, hey, I'm not dealing with these hens no more and their issues. I'm going to do it myself. So then you go down to Tractor Supply, spend about 50 bucks, and you get one of these here uh, little giants. And you take all the eggs that are anywhere from, I don't know, a day to a week old that you've been collecting, and you throw them in this little incubator here. And because you don't want to spend any extra money, you don't get the little egg turner. You just throw them right in there. And then when you're reading the directions, uh, instead of setting it at the 98 degrees or whatever it's supposed to be, you set it at 103 point something something that it says in those destructions, but nobody reads the instruction manual to you, so you have to do that yourself. But anyway, once you do that, then you can uh, get your egg set up in here. And since you don't have an automatic egg turner back in the pocket here, what we're going to do we're going to rotate these little babies by ourselves. Now, since you can't really trust the uh, the little thing on there, even though this is made in the USA, you got to check the thermometer in here. Make sure your temperature is good. Should be running just under 100 degrees. So, there's these little channels in here. You got to make sure that there's you keep water in those little channels and that keeps the humidity right and then on these eggs I've written odd and even so that I could turn the eggs on the odd days and the even days but you can see how well that works they just kind of go whichever direction they want so I put these in here on the 16th today is the 23rd so we can see what's going on if I can do this without dropping it since I'm trying to do it myself, put this in here. Maybe I can give you an idea what the, uh, so I don't know if you can see that little floaty in there with little veins coming out of it. That's what you're looking for. That's a good fertilized egg. <laughs> Fortunately, my rooster's doing what roosters are supposed to be doing. But I do have some that are questionable. I can't tell if there's anything happening there. So I'm keeping those over in this corner. And so, since I don't have an egg turner, then the next thing I gotta do is a couple times a day, I'll come in here and flip these babies over. I tried rotating them, it didn't work very well for me. So I just flip them in for end. Now, I could ask somebody else to do this, but I find it infinitely more satisfying if I just do it myself. So, we gotta wait for the 21 day incubation period, incubation, in yeah, incubation period. And after uh, 21 days, we'll find out what kind of little chickens hatch out of here. All right, have a good day.